Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm getting ready for the day. I'm actually about to do my makeup, except I'm gonna record this for YouTube as well. It's not gonna be a part of this vlog, but I'm gonna do like a separate makeup video because I have so many new products and I've been obsessed with them and I wanted to do like a new, like a little makeup get ready with me using new makeup products. Also, this is the current hair situation. I did fix it up a bit. I always have this part that like bumps out. I don't know why, but um, yeah, I always have that problem. But my hair is looking pretty good aside from that. And I also have my outfit on. I'm just wearing like this black top necklaces. This one keeps falling inside of my shirt. I'm wearing this. And I'm also wearing some Levi's jeans, which I absolutely love. If you haven't tried Levi's jeans yet, you have to try them. These are super good. These are high-waisted. Hi guys, so I'm back home and I went thrifting with my mom because she just decided to thrift. Um, I didn't really find much, but as you saw, I was like VHS shopping and like just browsing through everything there. And I found this Cindy Crawford Shape Your Body VHS tape, which I've been looking for everywhere. So I finally got it and I love these workout videos. A good low impact workout, that's really good. And I also found this Jane Fonda Lower Body Solution. And I love Jane Fonda. I have her workout book from the 80s. And I want to look for the other VHS tape. Hopefully I can find more. But yeah, these are... This is like my little thrift haul. A, B, C, D, E, F, G. Gummy bears are chasing me. One is red, one is blue. One is trying to sit my shit. Now I'm not running away. I'm going to let my gummy guy poof. You got that little live performance from my nephew. Um, I wanted to show you guys that I got a new bag. Is it surprising? No. Um, so I got this leather bag. It's an Italian leather bag and it's so nice and it smells like leather. You got so much bag. Yeah, I know that, yeah. Mm -hmm. Why I got so much bag? Because why not? <laughs> so I got this goodie bag from Urban Outfitters and the Pinterest event and it came with like a little miffy keychain, which is adorable, even though the legs are like uneven. But yeah, it's so cute. It's it's giving like Jane Birkin a little bit. Um, but I really love it and I've been carrying it like that. Um, literally excuse the way that I look right now. I, it just, it got so hot. It got so humid outside. I just had to tie my hair up with, well, I didn't tie it up. I just flipped it up with a hair claw clip, put my glasses on. Um, the humidity is literally like too much to handle right now. So I have AC on and I'm inside chilling, but I'm watching a new, it, well, it's a new series for me, but it's been on Netflix for a while. Um, I've been watching or like getting into a lot of like Spanish drama or like Spanish TV and movies So I'm watching a new Spanish TV show or TV series and it's pretty good a lot of it is like crime so I've been watching this one and I'm still like beginning it. It's very short. It's a limited series. It's pretty good I do feel like I've seen better ones, but this one's not bad I also wanted to show you guys what I have in my purse because for some reason I forgot to show you guys, so I showed you guys Miffy. I got this little Miffy at the Urban Outfitters event. I'm going to show you guys the other stuff I got as well because I got quite a lot of good stuff. I recently bought this Italian leather bag, and I love a good leather bag. Anyways, I have my glosses on. I've been keeping some gum with me, specifically bubble gum, because I feel like this might be the superior flavor, really, um, aside from like peppermint. That's pretty good. I also have a pair of sunglasses. These are the tortoise shell style. Just a regular sunglass frame. These are from Dime Optics. I like their sunglasses and I have quite a few pairs. 
um, from them. Um, I also have a hand lotion. This is the L'Occitane hand cream. Um, it's the lavender one from Provence and it smells super good, but I do love the shea butter one so much better. Um, it's thicker and I feel like it lasts better. This is very watery, but I still like it because it's small and it doesn't like take a long time for my hands to absorb. I also have this MEJ hair clip. This is the pink angel food and this is really cute. Like sometimes I'll just add it for like decoration on my hair. I also have a perfume. This is the Carolina Herrera good girl perfume i have this tiny little one and it's so cute and it smells divine i love this one but my favorite one is the blush one which i absolutely love and i cannot get enough of that one i also just put this in my bag but this is the rawa beauty smoothing hair balm I'm using this one for like my slick bag so i'm carrying this one for that reason specifically i also have this super cute little mirror i got this at tj maxx um it's the hello kitty impressions vanity mirror and it's the one that lights up this is rechargeable, um, but yeah, it changes like modes, you can dim it, do whatever you want with it, and yeah, it's perfect for a night out when you're touching up your lip combo. And talking about lip combos, I have my Rode Ribbon, yeah, Ribbon Lip Peptide Treatment and my NYX or NYX New Truffle Lip Liner. I also have my little wallet that I thrifted last year, and it's so cute. Actually, did I thrift this last year? I don't know if I thrifted it this year or last year. Also, just a few random hair ties and my brow brush because I got a brow lamination like a month and a half ago around there and it's lasted quite a while, but I feel like my eyebrows are suffering right now. Um, so I always have to brush them. And I also am carrying this Huda Beauty little, I think it's the Easy Bake, Baby Bake, Loose Baking and Setting Powder. And this is so incredibly cute. Like, look at how many it is and look at the packaging. It has a little powder puff in it. Um, so perfect for on-the-go touch-ups. I want to show you guys the Urban Outfitters goodie bag that I got at the event. Um, so it's this bow bag. I think this is the kimchi blue bag. I got it in black and it's so cute. But I got that and I also got this adorable little candle and it smells incredible. It smells like sugar plum. This is so cute. I'm planning on like burning it and then like using this as like a little trinket dish. So I got that candle and then to light the candle up, I got a lighter and it says yum on it and it has like a little cake on it. Um, this is, like, you cannot tell me that this is not the cutest lighter you've seen. It's an electric lighter. <laughs> I've never had one of these. I always wanted them. I also got these reusable under eye pads, and they're, like, sparkly. Um, they're, like, gel. And it's so much fun to, like, squish, because you can see it separating on the side. Also got this Nesso Niso Wellness Premium Incense Papers. I've never used this, but it sounds pretty interesting but the scent is a little overwhelming for my nose. I also got a fragrance. This is the Noir Distillé uh, Pure Perfume Roller. I know I'm butchering the name, but I um, kind of want to try it out because I haven't even tried it. It smells really good though. I saw the notes online and it's like a vanilla -y smell and it smells really good, wow. That's what I got in a goodie bag. And also as a bonus, I literally met Alex Kansani. I'm pretty like 100% sure I saw Steven Morea. I should have ran after him to take a picture with him, but I was waiting in line for this Aura Polaroid picture, even though like it took like forever. I never even got the photo taken um, because Tanache came out and sang at that moment um but yeah i missed out on steven morea and i missed out on being right in front of tanache so that's my fault for choosing to make that long ass line and i also missed out on like the coquette bow girly room which is literally like my aesthetic so i took a quick shower and i did not wash my hair because it's still pretty good so i'm gonna do some skincare right now i'm gonna do a mud mask i haven't done a mud mask or a face mask in a while actually I'm using this kiehl's rare earth deep pore cleansing mask and you can tell i've used it quite a bit i'm gonna use this one i'm not breaking out as bad as the other day but just for funsies it's friday and i'm just gonna sit down and watch my show honestly after the urban outfitters event the other day the other night i was literally like left all beat because i was wearing heels it was incredibly hot so my feet kept slipping inside of my shoes i feel like that caused me discomfort with the shoes that i was wearing i'm gonna leave this on for a bit 
and then I'll wash it off. Um, but yeah, just a really chill night today or like a really chill day today. Because I went to the cafe that you guys saw earlier in the video. And then I also ended up going thrifting with my mom. And I found those cute VHS tapes that I have to watch soon. I'm going to do finish up my skincare routine. I am using this Rode peptide fluid. I am trying to like use it up. I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm almost done with it. Um, I already finished the moisturizer. I finished that pretty quickly. Yeah, I'm using this peptide fluid. Honestly, I'm not sure what peptide really is for, but you know what? It's a pretty good product. I mean, I love the peptide lip treatments. Those are my favorite things from like Rode, aside from the milk, the glazing milk. I'm also using the Cetaphil moisturizing lotion. I just applied it on my hands already. I also have some dry lips, so... I'm using this Fenty Skin Lip Oil. It's the cherry treat. And I love how it smells. It smells like literal like cherry candy. Mm -hmm. 